sheriff around these parts. And you might be wondering what brings me here today to talk to you. You might even be a little bit worried. You probably should be. You see, the nature of my address is a negative one. It's a matter of deep concern and security. It's because these premises, yes, the place we call home sweet home, is being violated. By who, you might ask? By a bunch of no good, dirty, rotten pig snatchers. That's right. They've been traipsing around these parts for decades. Generations even. Snatching all our swine. See this man right here? This is my great granddaddy, the circuit rider. This man rode old blue all around from this side of the Mississippi looking for the pig snatchers. And I declare, I will avenge his death. And after much investigation, we've narrowed the perpetrators down to a few. But we know from evidence that we have accumulated that only two of them are the true pig snatchers, and we need your help to catch them. That's right. So here's what you're going to do. We're going to play a little game, if you will, although this is a very serious matter. Just remember this. Pennies are positive points. Anything else is a negative point. Now listen, you want your class of citizen to have the most positive points at the end. So put all your pennies into your own jar and put everything else you have into the jars of the other classes, the other perpetrators' jars, if you will. At the end of this, we will know who those two, those two criminals are, and they will be punished. We're going to avenge Granddaddy Circuit Rider. You want to know what the punishment is, don't you? Because I have spent many a sleepless night trying to figure it out. Trying to find a punishment that fits the crime. And I've got it. So here it is, folks. Those who we find guilty will have to place their criminal lips on the snout of a genuine swine. That's right. One of the little piggly wigglies that they stole. There could be saliva. There could even be a little tongue. But I know you good folks will choose the right outlaws.